Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. So in this video I'll be taking a look at unboxing, testing and reviewing this feeder fishing chair made by Ultimate which I bought from fishdeal.co.uk last September. So the feeder chair came in this box, Ultimate Rotterdam. So everything was well packed, no problem with the packaging. And then the chair, here is the chair, it came in its own carry bag. So what I was looking for was a cheap budget feeder chair that I could use for feeder fishing and also use for carp fishing when I want to go carp fishing, take it to do that. And I wanted something lightweight, useful and cheap. So I paid for this chair with all its accessories, £55.40 very cheap and I think um, it's it's any feeder chair for that price uh, would seem to be a good deal so it has this bag nice material Valpro top I've already had a look at this earlier on and took all the packaging off um, we'll just get that out of the way and all the bits Yeah, there's the bag. Not a bad bag at all. It's got the carry handle on the top. Okay. And then it came with all of these accessories. I'll probably upgrade these accessories at some point, uh, especially these heads. Came with these feeder heads. They're not excellent quality, but I didn't expect them to be. And I can just add my own on here anyway. They're okay, they'll, they'll do the job. There's the other one. So this chair allows you to attach arms to it to uh, add your rod rest and your bait tray. It came with four of these. So you've got one for the front rod rest, one for the back rod rest, one for the bait tray, and then one for other items. You might be able to attach an umbrella on there somehow or a bait waiter, something like that. So let's start off with looking at the bait tray. The bait tray, nice size, as you can see, quite a large size. It's got the little holes in each corner in case it gets wet to let the water out. It's already got the attachments in here so that it fits onto the pole that you're given. But you could take these out and you could actually use these on a seat box as well. You can see there's different size fittings there so this would probably fit on um, most seat boxes as well so very lightweight tray it's all plastic quality it's not excellent quality it's a little on the, the plasticky flimsy side but um, I didn't expect a lot at this price point and it will get the job done and more importantly it's very lightweight you can see it weighs almost nothing so as long as you are careful with this it should be good I'll look after it, should be all right. And like I say, there's these four attachments. Two of them have got adjustable heads on to get your rod rest at the right kind of angle and height. And then the other two, one of them is just flat at the end there. And the other one has a thread in the end so you can screw some onto it. And these all fit into the chair. So for £55.40, I've got a bait tray, I've got four of these attachments, I've got two rod rest heads, I've got a carry bag, and I've got the chair itself. So here is the chair, it's a very basic, straightforward chair. It is nice and lightweight, I can tell you now, it's, it's very light and it packs down very slim, really slim, really lightweight. And these legs don't flop out they kind of hold their position they're adjustable legs all four legs are adjustable as you can see here height adjustable legs all four they've got these mud feet on hopefully they'll hold up long enough so it's just a standard sort of budget chair but it has these areas attached to it welded to it and these lock in place by the way the, the legs 
they lock down. There's a lever that allows it to lock into place. Here's the chair, and you can see here are the attachments. So, for example, you push your arm into here and you can tighten it up and then you can add something on here uh, like a rod rest head or the bait tray will go on here not on this one actually let me just swap this out These lock into place nicely. Bait tray can then go on. Like so. And you've got your bait tray on there. Difficult to film, it's raining outside so I'm doing it in the shed. But you get the idea. No problem there. So potentially a very useful chair. It is just a standard basic chair, no frills. There's not much to say about the chair. Um, the front and back legs do have a little lock pin, which I like, so you know that they're not gonna fold in on you and you're not gonna sort of fall over while you're fishing. And a lot of the green of the can, uh, the, this, this material is a nice shade of green. These attachments, once they're screwed in, they're relatively solid. There's not a problem there, really. Decent, decent enough. As I say, I mean the bait tray and the two rod rests are a little bit on the low end side. I mean, I don't know how long these will last. They probably won't last years. I mean, it will do the they will do the job, but who who's to say how long they will last? And anyway, you can always replace these quite easily. Even the bait tray, you could always buy a bait tray anyway, but. There's nothing really wrong with it, it's it's functional, it's a good size. So for that kind of price, £55.40, I've got a chair, I've got a bait tray, I've got two rod rest heads and I've got all the attachments that I need to put it on. So I think that's a pretty good deal. Um, I don't know how long this chair will last. It seems okay, I like the look of it, it seems okay quality, it should last a couple of years or maybe even longer I don't know but um, my first impressions of it are it, it's good for the the money good value for money and uh, I'm going to start using this soon for some nice relaxing ledger feeder fishing So here is the ultimate feeder chair, which I bought last year from fishdeal.co.uk, I believe. And this is the first time I'm using it as a feeder chair. I've been using it as a carp chair and it's worked well. It's nice and lightweight, but you can see now I've got all the attachments on. I've got the back arm on holding up the rod. There's the front arm. And I'm also using the bait tray and the arm on the other side. As far as the rests go, I'm using this set made by Guru. I'm not using the original set that come with this chair. If you'd like to see a quick video on me doing like a first impressions video of these rod rests, I'll leave a link to that video in the description box. As you can see, these rod rests are doing a great job at keeping the rod in a nice position there at arm's reach nice and close to the water's edge these can be adjusted as well so you can have them at sort of a right angle upright and they're like a hexagon shape so you can take them out and move them as I've done with the front one here as you can see I've put this one at an angle but you could have that straight up if you want and you can adjust them to make them longer and shorter to get your rod just where you want it here is the bait tray, you can raise and lower the bait tray. Good sized tray and it's got little holes in it for um, drainage in case it rains. And you can adjust all of the rests in and out so you can have them close to you or far away. 
and you can adjust them this way as well very useful the chair itself is reasonably comfortable it's not the most comfortable chair i've ever sat in but it's quite simple in design and it's very lightweight which i really like um, i think it's a decent chair overall i've used it three or four times so far so as you can see i'm sitting in the chair currently i'm about around 85 kilos and i'm sitting comfortably And the rod is in a nice place here, just at arm's reach. And here is the bag that it comes in, decent quality bag. It can fit everything in it easily, keep everything together nicely. Okay, so that is about it for this video. So my final conclusions of this really lightweight chair. It's just that it's really lightweight as you can see. You can hold it out with one hand. Really compact, small, relatively comfortable. Comfortable enough for um, a session anyway. And uh, I like it, it's good. It hasn't broke yet. I've used it probably four or five times now. It's got adjustable legs. So, you can adjust the height on all four legs to get it just how you want it. And it comes with all those accessory arms that you can add on. Um, I don't really have anything bad to say about it, considering the price, it is still for sale. And I still think it's a very good deal. So in conclusion, I think it's a pretty good chair, pretty good value for money. So if you're looking for a feeder chair, I hope this video helped you in making a decision. If you did like this video, Please remember to like and also consider subscribing for more fishing related videos. And as always, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.